Hello and welcome Zamora Gaming fans. I am your host Joe Zamora here and I am bringing you the semifinals of PML Draft Singles. Alright guys, so we do have Jesse who we lost to in week one. That's when there was that whole uh, Naganadale Dynamax fiasco and we lost 1-0. But um, here we go. We got to try to win it this time around. His team is a little bit different, but not much. Uh, I do see that he brought Gardevoir this time around. And uh, I think he had Rotomo last time. But uh, I don't remember uh, Gardevoir last time. I forget who he actually brought. Oh, Skarmory. He brought Skarmory instead of Gardevoir. So this is going to be a little interesting. So I don't see him getting uh, reliable hazards up at the beginning of this battle. So we're going to go ahead and lead off with Red Vines here to try to get ours off. And we'll see how this goes. All I can say is good luck, have fun, Jesse. And let's go ahead and get this battle underway. So we, if you saw last week, we squeaked by in our first round of the playoffs. So hopefully this time around, we don't have to rely on luck. Okay, so he does lead Rotom. And uh, who do we have here? He's probably going to trick us with the Scarf. I'm going to go ahead and lead Slice over since we're already Scarfed. And we'll see how that goes. So I did bring uh, Ninetales for the... Uh, for the... Uh, what do you call it? For the Skarmory, because I didn't have an answer for that last time around. But this time around, uh, we did. Sadly, he didn't bring it. But also, better case scenario, because we don't have to worry about it now. So here we are Scarfed. So we can pretty much hit this thing with whatever we want. Uh, I guess let's go ahead and go for the flamethrower here. We'll hit it pretty hard, and we have the sun out to help us too. And if we get Gardevoir out of the way, that'd be great. Alright, so he does get the hypnosis off, which is not good for us. Uh, let's hope he doesn't start calm minding here. Let's wake up. So he gets the 50% sleep off. Let's hope we get the first turn wake. He's certainly taking a minute to pick his move. Uh, he stays in. And he goes for the side shock here. Uh, and it does knock us out. So we do got to be weary of that. All right. I don't know if it's early enough to pull this trigger. So let's go ahead and go to El Toro. Uh, we do have the Lumberry, so it would have prevented the sleep. But I don't know if I can sweep his team just yet. He does have... Uh, he does have pretty fast mons in Scizor to worry about. We could have pulled the trigger. Oh, man, I'm stupid. That would have been perfect time. Okay, that's fine. Let's go ahead and just get the kill on Gardevoir. We should be faster, no problem. And we are. Down goes Gardevoir and also his only fairy type. So we're free to outrage now. All right, let's see what he goes for here. Naganadel and Talonflame are two good answers. They're both faster. But uh, I don't know if they can take me out. Uh, more than likely, uh, Naganadel can, but I don't know if he wants to risk us living and 
or even Dynamaxing on it. So of course Talon Flame comes in here. And I'm just gonna click Outrage. Okay, he goes Tailwind, so he's gonna be faster than anything we got. And Talonflame actually lives the Outrage. So he's certainly getting speed control on his side. And I feel that's a big setup for uh, Naganadel as well. Okay, so we take that really well. And now we uh, see if we have one more turn of Outrage or if he's going to switch into Naganadel. Oh yeah, we're confused. So now Naganado is prime here to come in. But no matter what, we're staying in and clicking a move. Interesting move. He goes with Rotom here. And we're going to go ahead and just click. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and click uh, Outrage. Free move. Free, free hit if we uh, live. And we don't. All right, let's see what he's going to switch out to here. Okay, this should be the fourth turn of Trick Room. I mean, not Trick Room, sorry. Uh, Tailwind. And we're going to go ahead and get our Stealth Rocks up here. Stealth Rocks is more important than keeping Ferrothorn alive. We are Sash, so we'll live the we'll live the Fire Blast. And this way we're wasting the Tailwind here. And he's going for the Max here. All right, most likely going to go for the Max Flare, knowing that it'll knock us out. But um, we are sashed again, so we'll live it, no problem. And most importantly, we get our rocks up to break any sashes on his future mons. Alright, uh, no more, no more, uh, Tailwind. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the, I'm gonna go for the Toxic here. I mean, I don't think we're faster, but Toxic isn't bad to get off on this thing. Yep, no, okay. So it's still sitting at full. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and go to... Hmm. Let's go ahead and go to Snowflake here. Uh, get the freeze? <laughs> Sorry, I know I said we don't need luck, but I think we need luck right now. Um, he does have three more Pokemon to worry about. So we're just going to go for the Ice Beam here to get some chip damage off. Alright, and even with that, Max Flare is going to take us out most likely. Yep. Alright, and we do see that he is Leftovers and not Assault Vest. Not that it matters too much. All right, right here, we are baiting in the Draco Meteor. That's the main thing we're doing here. Bait in Draco Meteor, lower its special attack, come in, uh, try to get a Dragon's Dance, and then just sweep from there.
Oh, he goes for Ice Beam. He's safe. Playing it real safe. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and go for the side shock here because Guja is not as defensively bulky. Dude, switching to Gonadel. Do it. I dare you. <laughs> He's thinking about doing something. I'm not sure what that is. But at least at this point in the match, we break sashes and we are pretty good to sweep the rest of his team. We are Moxie. All right, so Ice Beam officially takes out Vision here. And now it's all up to uh, Salamence to take a hit from Naganadel, really. So if Jesse plays his cards right, he'll leave Naganadel in the back all the way to the end of Dynamax. Because we can't afford to uh, take a hit here in Dragon Dance. Oh, man, that sucks. Because we will not live an Ice Beam. Will we? Let's see. So first calc of the season. That's where it matters. Salamance versus Gudra. Um, Ice Beam. Oh, yeah. That for sure kills. <laughs> so we're just going to go ahead for Max Dragon. Oh, you know what? Yeah, Max Dragon. And let's hope we get the win here. Let's do it. We're doing it. All in. We should have done this earlier. We should have done this earlier. We could have got the dragon dance up and everything. We would have been fine. Ah oh, man, that's good. I hope that doesn't come back to bite us. But here we go. Draco's max cheer, and we're going for the max dragon. This should take out Gudra no problem. And down it goes. So we're plus one. Moxie boosted, baby. Let's go. And I think we're safe to Max Dragon everything except Scizor. Alright, so this thing's most likely Scarfed, so it's going to get a hit off on us for sure. Oh no, it's not Scarfed. Fooled me. But nonetheless, it goes down no problem. Man, we really got to worry about living a hit from Naganadel. Please come in now. Nope, says or he's playing it smart. And if he has Draco Meteor, it for sure knocks us out. So let's go ahead and go for the uh, Max Flare, maybe. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and go for the Max Flare. All right, Bullet Punch knocks us lower, which is not good. Max Flare should knock this thing out. And it does. Oh, man, I'm stupid. I should have Dragon Dance. I should have wasted the Dynamax turn. Dragon Dance. Oh, no. I think I threw the game there. I could have took the hit. I could have I could have protected Dragon Dance, take two hits, and then outsped the Naganda down next turn. Alright guys, well that is my mistake and most likely what's gonna cost us the end of this match. Oh man. That was a bonehead play on my part. Now we really do have to live this hit.
Well, let's hope he went Dragon Pulse instead of Dragon uh, Draco Meteor, and maybe we'll have a chance to live it. I doubt it, but GG either way, Jesse. I'm stupid. I misplayed that in game so bad. Hindsight's 2020, though. All right, Dragon Pulse. Do we live? Oh, we don't. Oh, man. Well, that's going to be the end of our season, ending in another semifinals. But he played that much better than we did. GG, J-Dog. And uh, good luck in the championship match.